What up nerds? My name is Leslie Smith. Welcome back to the Nerdy Narrative where today I'm going to do a new different type of video to the channel. I'm going to do a stationary vlog. I got a whole bunch of stuff that I want to share with you. I had some birthday money that was burning a hole in my pocket. So I bought a pen, I bought some inks, I bought some sticker stuff for my journal. So I wanted to share all of that with you. Just swatch the inks, show you the stickers and just have a little bit of fun. So I hope that you're ready because I am. Let's just jump right into it. First up that I have that I want to show you is my new fountain pen that I got. I got myself a Lamy. I went on to Gold Spot hankering after the new Violet Limited Edition All-Star that they had for this year, but then another one caught my eye. The tourmaline color, or maybe it's tourmaline. I just thought this teal color was absolutely gorgeous. If you've been around my channel for a while, you've probably seen a lot of teal decorations in the background here and there. That's one of my favorite colors. It's what I accent my house. Funny story, I ordered this with the silver fine nib, but it wasn't displaying enough ink for me. I love writing with shimmer and sheens and those types of inks just don't work well with a fine nib. So I did get a medium nib that I swapped out. The Lamy's are awesome. They just slide on and off and I got the black one, which I think just looks really gorgeous with this part right here. I love this pen. I have been writing with it nonstop since I got it. It's my accent color in my journal, which where is it? There it is. It's just absolutely gorgeous. All of this beautiful bright green is from my Lamy pen, which I'm trying to see if I can capture any of the shimmer in this lighting. You can really see it if you look at about right here. See how that pretty shimmer will capture in the light just a little bit? Okay, now that I've said that, there it goes, there it goes. But I put in it the new ink that I also got, which is the Colorverse 2023 New Year color. It is beautiful and it's perfect for March and St. Patrick's Day. It's a beautiful bright green that has green and gold shimmer in it. I have been using it and absolutely loving it. Now, what else did I get? I also got from Colorverse this South Beach ink. Apparently they match inks to places that you live and this is Miami Beach in Florida, I believe. Speaking of ink, I also have here this is, I have no idea how to pronounce it, so I'm just going to show it to you. I'll have all of these items linked in the description box down below if you would like to look at them online and order one for yourselves. But this color is absolutely gorgeous. One of my pen pal friends sent me a letter written in this ink and Chris and I just fell in love. So we got us a bottle of that. And why don't we go ahead and just stop here and swatch these really quick. So I have these really cute Beverly stamps that I got from Jet Pens. I'll have a link down below. And then I got this ink pad. It's the only one they have that's the type of ink that you can color in with a marker or with a fountain pen and it not run. You just have to, of course, let it dry first. So I love using these to show off my ink swatches. First up, we're going to have the glistening 2023 New Year color verse. This green is just absolutely gorgeous. I hope some of the shimmer shows up in it. See all the pretty gold shimmer in it? I just adore it. It is gorgeous. And this is... Twenty twenty three New Year. Love it. Just love it. Oh, I just I do this all the time. I will just sit with my journal under a light and just flicker and flutter the pages so I can see how pretty the sparkle is. Okay, let's move on to the next one. I cannot wait to ink up a pen with this one. Oh my god. Look at how bright blue that is. That is absolutely gorgeous. Just gorgeous. Now, I don't have a pen inked up with this one just yet. That is 
is just too beautiful. So if you see up close here, it's got a shimmer to it. It is so incredibly hard to show the shimmer on camera. Ooh, here you go. You can see it right here. Oh my gosh. Look at how beautiful that is. I am so excited to put that one in a pen. So we're going to go to the last one, which it looks a little funny because I was resting my palm on it. And so, yeah, that's just great. So let's pop open this Colorverse South Beach. Look how cute the box is. That's cute. Okay. Oh, oh, there we go. All right. Now Chris picked this one out. What a interesting shaped bottle. Okay. Can't really tell what it's going to look like. So let's just plunge in. Okay, that is really similar to this one that I can't pronounce up here. Looks a little brighter, perhaps. Oh, wow. That definitely looks like a good beachy color, like you would find on the Emerald Coast. That's pretty. It's more... Let me zoom out so you can see it next to the other one. It has a little more green in it. It just looks just like the ocean though. I love it. I love it. Here are all three of the colors and wow, you can really see that shimmer in it now. That is just absolutely gorgeous. I can't wait to ink that up in a pen. So we've talked new fountain pen. We've talked inks. Let's talk about some stickers. I have two orders here from the Coffee Monsters Co. I got them in over the weekend and I decided to wait and open them on camera and show you all. If you watch any of my journal videos, you have absolutely seen the Coffee Monsters Co. stickers in every single one of them. They are just absolutely the cutest. And I'm not sure. Okay, these I actually ordered myself. I got some really cute manicure stickers that I can put down when I'm going to get a manicure. Let's see. This one is for changing the bed sheets. Oh my gosh. These are so freaking cute. I tell you, I love doing chores when I have super cute little stickers that I can put down for them. So I got a couple of those. <gasps> Look how cute these little currently reading emojis are. Oh my gosh, these are going to be, <gasps> look, book haul, new book, cliffhanger. Are you serious? <laughs> Finished book, did not finish. Oh gosh, I would have used all of those up last month. Oh my gosh, look at this one is crying. These are precious. I'm going to have to get more of these. I think I got these just to kind of take a look at and see what I thought about them. Definitely going to have to have more of those. <gasps> look at the fountain pen emojis. Oh my goodness. I have to put one down. Is that a Lamy pen right there? <gasps> I'm pretty sure it is. So I need to put down this one on the day I got my Lamy pen. <gasps> oh Oh my gosh. Look at the little one under the cover with the coffee reading a book. I am just over the moon with how cute and precious these are. So, oh yay, I got more of these. Oh my goodness. They are absolutely the most precious. <laughs> Look at the garbage one. <laughs> oh man. Yep, that's, yep. The appropriate definitely appropriate so I got some of those put down from my garbage days what else do I have in here oh I went ahead and just got a year's worth grocery shopping cute oh good I got a couple of those oh and the puppy ones for Milo and Bandit when they need baths and to go for a walk oh and the vet these are so so cute. I got a couple little samplers. I cannot wait to use these in my journal. <gasps> so cute. And then I have another package here, which I'm thinking might be my first subscription. 
so she started doing a subscription service and I signed up for the one that was quarterly, which the quarterly subscription, you get the stuff that's sent out in the monthly one and the other one. There's like two other tiers, but if you do quarterly, you get everything that came in those two tiers, if that makes sense. I'll have her website linked down below so you can check it out. <gasps> Potatoes take revenge. That is hilarious. So what is this? Oh, wait a minute. I think these are what I ordered with birthday money. Oh my word. Yes, this is what I ordered with birthday money. So my subscription one hasn't come in yet. This is a new release she did to Lucky Charms. So I got two of the Lucky Charms washi tape. Oh my goodness. This is so cute. Look at this planner one. Oh my gosh. I am dying. These are going to be so precious. Oh, so I got two of every one of them. Yay me. Blob mode <laughs> in my tummy. <gasps> these are new. I haven't seen these before. Oh, how cute. Oh. So those are just little freebies. So that's funny. I guess we're gossiping together. Oh, tea and gossip. Duh. <gasps> Swatch pins. So I can put that one down today. Oh my goodness. <sighs> How freaking precious. And then I bought the Lucky Charms kit to decorate in my journal. <gasps> These are so stinking cute. Oh, oh, I forgot about these. These are washi holders. You put your little, you open it up and put your washi tape in it that you're gonna use and you close it up. Um, which way? And then you can just, and I got two of them. She would allow you to buy two at a time. I don't like my washi tape to be uneven. I always use a ruler to tear mine off, but I usually decorate with washi at the top of my pages and then I do it on my weekly view. I'll do a little skinny one up top and I do a big one down below, but look how cute. So this is just Monday and Tuesday of this week. Like here's my little vacuum emoji and when I work, I have some little working emojis. And I also have stamps that I use. So I kind of back and forth between the two. But I just want to have a cute little fun something that just shows what I did in the day. And so that is what I do with all of these little emoji stickers. They just look so cute when you're tracking out your days. If I haven't cleaned something in a day, I will go clean something just so I can put down one of these super cute little emojis. I am so excited to use my new ones. And that is going to do it. That's all of the stuff that I've gotten as far as stationery this week. I have some more coming because I have more birthday money. So I will share that with y'all. This is the first time I've done anything like this on the channel. But if you like it, let me know and I'll keep doing it. I usually get something stationary in the month, sometimes lots of stationary. So I'll definitely be happy to share if it's something you all enjoy. So thank you all so much for watching. Have a fantastic rest of your day and I'll catch you in the next one. I thought I was done with my stationary haul when I filmed. And then I got another order from a different sticker shop in. So I decided to edit it in real quick. This is my other favorite sticker shop. I am either buying from the Cookie Monsters Co. or Every Minute a Story. I'll have both shops linked in the description below. And I actually forgot what this even is. I got birthday money and I just kind of went crazy on at the sticker shops. Just stacking up on stuff. Oh, look how sweet that is. And she even spelled my name right. That is just absolutely precious. <gasps> oh my goodness. Alright, you know what? First, let me just fold this over right here like that. That way, none of my stickers will accidentally get stuck to it. Oh, look how cute. So, y'all know I love me some coffee, right? I had to have the cute little emoji coffee. 
Oh, I am in love. Coffee because adulting is hard. So I got a couple of those. And then I got this one. Oh, okay. So this must have been a little coffee kit, probably. Oh my gosh. Look how freaking cute these are. <gasps> oh, I am absolutely, yes, that is totally me. In love. Oh my goodness. I love these to do stamps so much. I have a few kits from Every Minute of the Story. All of the to do tabs are gone. Like, I use those first. Oh, these are so precious. And my little freebie, my little avocado, I've got a couple of those. These are so cute. I keep these because usually, and I'm going to keep this one anyway because she wrote me a little thank you note on it and I put these in my journal. But a lot of times, these little journal cards I will use to write notes on and then I'll use washi tape to secure them inside my journal. Let's see, I can show you an example of that because... You know I've got my journal here. This vellum that I put on the front of my Hobonichi cousin, that's every minute of story. My little bookmark, that's every minute of story. There's one right here. So I did a live show on this particular Saturday. It was for the Wine and Crime Book Club. And I put my notes, it was the Thursday Murder Club. And I put my notes on the back of the little card. And then I just put it in with a little piece of washi tape. Oh, and here's the other one. Oh my goodness. See how cute these are? So helpful. Uh love them. So I cannot wait to use these. And let's look at all the washi. So what do I got here? Oh, I have coffee washi tape, mocha. A, what is this on? Like, let me get this plastic off. It's got coffee and we have a little plant and a little pen. What's this one? To do washi. Yes. I'm going to use these. So what I like to use which I guess I can show y'all that too. If we're just going to demonstrate, let's just demonstrate. On my daily pages, I put my to-do list and that's where I use those. So I can use this cute little washi there. Oh my goodness. So I got two of those. Yay. Oh, look how freaking precious that is. Oh my goodness. So we've got books and coffee and I just have freaking sticky stuff all over me. I'm not sure what I got into. Did I have, this is my only one of this one so far. So it's a little cafe. It's a coffee shop. Oh my goodness. Look at the coffee cups and the coffee beans. <sighs> Strong, brave, enough, loved. Oh my goodness. And then another to do. I am in love. Okay. And I also... <laughs> got one more ink in I want to show you all. So I decided I wanted to try this brand. I'm not sure how to say it. Wearing Gill, Wearing Gill, but I have seen it on Instagram and I decided I wanted to try some myself. And it is, this is written in Japanese, but it's the color of grape. I forget. I'll put it in the description box below, but look at this beautiful purple shimmer and I did write with it and do a little swatch which I can show y'all here hopefully I can get that shimmer to catch in the lights and you can see how beautiful it is and I just have absolutely loved it I inked it immediately I just had to it was beautiful I have a feeling this is going to stay in a pen permanently at least until I use it all and there's another piece of plastic like I don't know what this plastic is but that is it. That is for sure. Well, actually, I think I do have some more stuff coming. <laughs> that can wait till the next one. Okay, that's it. I'm going to go edit this, get this up, share with y'all, and just... This is so cute. I am absolutely in love with this coffee. <gasps> this coffee theme. It is just so precious. I am dying. Okay, that's it. I'm out of here. Y'all have a great one. I'll catch you in the next one.